Hello everyone, this is a heavily requested video. Can you make pizza in a toaster? I am very curious too. So today I'm going to try to make a pizza. Not to make, but to reheat. To bake a pizza in a toaster. So, I have no idea how this would work. But first, let's see our pizza. It's a chicken barbecue pizza. My favorite pizza, to be honest. I have a feeling that this will not fit in the toaster, but who knows what if it works. So, first challenge. If you put it sideways, all the topping is going to fall off. So we have to tilt the toaster this way. And then we got another challenge. It doesn't really fit. That's not ideal. Probably you have to cut it up first. Now, as you can see with the four pieces, it can now perfectly fit into the toaster. So, how would it work? I'm going to try two methods. The first one, I'm going to put the pizza directly in the toaster. The second one, I'm going to put it in the aluminum foil. Basically, safer method. Would it work? Let's find out. The manual says 10 to 14 minutes, so that's how long I'm going to wait facing the camera. I already smell something burning. Okay, time skip. One, two. So, at three minutes, the toaster. So, that was a bad idea. It triggered the smoke alarm and it's burned. It's completely burned. More of the story, do not toast pizza without aluminum foil. However, this one seems intact. There is no smoke from it. This one triggered the smoke alarm. Not good. Very not good. Bad. Okay, don't try this at home. I told you with my own experience. But this one should be safe. It's got aluminum foil. So, I'm going to do it. There's no smoke coming from this one, so hopefully it's safe. I will tell you again, do not do this at home. It's dangerous and it's the waste of pizza. All burned very bad. Do not do this. Okay, after toasting this pizza four times, hopefully it's working. You know what, it kind of worked. Probably. So I don't know what's the temperature of the toaster. The manual says 400 degrees Fahrenheit. Hopefully it's high enough temperature. I have no idea. The toaster doesn't have a temperature setting. So I guess we will just find out by trying it out. Okay, another six minutes. Let's see if this time this works. Hopefully... Oh, it's very hot. So, the texture of this tastes very weird. It's a bit too crunchy. Because this thing has no temperature control. I have no idea that if I overcook or undercook the pizza. Anyways, the chicken in this pizza is very dry. So I think I might have overdone it. And the pizza crust is a bit too hard. Very possible that I overdone. I think because the toaster do not have a temperature control system. It's very hard to control temperature of the pizza. Since the pizza itself is a raw product. 
I think it's very unsafe to do this in a toaster. Take away from this. Please do not try making pizza from a toaster. If you don't use aluminum foil, it will burn. If you use aluminum foil, it will not burn, but it's very hard to control if it is actually cooked or not. So very unsafe, very unhealthy. Yes, possible to get sick from food poisoning very like okay do not try this at home i'm going to wrap this up and see you next time please remember to subscribe and smash like now for the youtube algorithm okay see you next time and some other uses for these two pieces